Welcome back everybody, Trin 608 Plays, playing Kenshi here. I did have Molly sell off a bunch of the electronical components. Uh, I had these three run out. There was a couple of dead bodies I could loot, so I took those and got a few thousand cat. I basically got a few thousand cats ahead on everything there. Um, I do have... These guys are farming. They're waiting for some farms to come up. These guys are still generating um, iron plates here. So we're getting up there. We're getting about ready to make a run back up to our other iron storage plate size. Get a few more iron plates and we'll run those up. Uh, for Molly's crew, Fumin is still making more medical supplies. Slink is... I don't know why I have it blocking. Uh, Slink is doing this here. Uh, Tech-wise, what we're doing, uh, she's making iron clubs just to get up her skill. I'm trying to get this skill, this weapon smelling skill, up to 70 or better, like Meow's. Meow's is up to armor smith 75, because they have a better chance of making their uh, specialist grade of whatever they're making. Um, for leather armor. She, she can only make these two things. So, uh, we're going to make rattan hats. They are... They don't give you much resistance of anything, but, uh... I think that I need to put those on some of these people that are not in com in com uh, what was it these guys here these two have bows so they need to have those hats on because uh, it these helmets are really hurting their ability to do things he's still making standard first aid kits uh, she's making bandanas when she's on the clothing bench uh, Molly will still make meat wraps. I probably should never just quit that because we don't have any meat. I should probably have her make cooked vegetables. Because with eight green fruit and whatever she can make, we have lots of green fruit now. But uh, Molly right now is doing... She's operating the uh, electrical workbench to make more components so we can sell them off. And that's where everybody else is at. Now, here, like I said, uh, Rike is up. His stomach still is healing, but all of his other stuff isn't full. Uh, you'll notice his, uh, over here, he's only moving at 10 miles an hour. That's because I have him having all sorts of extra uh, equipment now. Uh, I put him in the black plate jacket with the hat. And then I gave him one of the wooden backpacks with all the meat and his sleeping bag and this. And it's like, this weighs a kilogram, this weighs five kilograms. These each weigh one kilogram each, so he has a whole lot of weight there. Um, I did want to check out what's in this farm thing to see if maybe Logan or Dren can bring back some green fruit. And from a tech point of view... It's only going to be seven hours till the mercenaries leave me, so I'm going to try and do some quick shopping. I'm going to check out what's in here, and I think I'm going to check out uh, the library again, see if they got anything new. Um, I don't think this was a mechanical shop. I don't think there was anything I needed in here. This was a headgear shop, which I didn't really go into. I don't think I really need anything there. He might have books. Should we run in there and see if he has books for headgear? This was the bow thing, which I bought the long boats things. I bought a skeleton repair kit so that I can... Uh, I know that one of these mercenary companies has a skeleton in it, so I want to be able to heal that skeleton up if he gets hurt. With my help thing, what I've done is in the... Where is it? In the AI, I have turned on to help allies, heal allies, uh, 
I still have ditch items. P Someone told me that if I unclick this, then people won't automatically put things into storage. So if like you want to pick up a bunch of bandages before you go out on uh, a run or whatever, you click this off, get everybody armored up the way they want, get them away from the storage bins, and then turn it back on for your people that are doing repetitive tasks. Okay? So uh, I'm not really interested in the rain shop. Uh, I want to check out the farming building, this, and the library, and then rehire up mercenaries as many as I can, and we'll head back out across the desert. That's our plan for the day. So we're going to run in here real quick. We'll come back to the farming village and then wait for the mercenaries to end their contract so I can rehire them for many days. Four days. Two days or whatever I can. Looking for something. Of course I'm looking for something. Why do you think I came into your shop? You silly person, you. Where are you? Oh, you're way over here. We have to go over here. Look, I have many mercenaries. So, what have you got? What have you got? Uh, he's got a topper. Oh! A Model 2 Mark II topper. Oh, oh. I'm getting attacked. Bloody heck. Hot longs. What are you doing? What are these things? Dust bandits. This is not good. All right. All of you, attack them all. Let's see if we can survive this. Oh, I should slow this down. Where are these guys going? Oh, they're going to attack my farmers. Oh, get my farmers involved too. Let's we'll see how good we do. That long seems to be doing okay. Griffin's having troubles. Where are the rest of my people? Kang, where are you and why are you not there? There you are. Taking your good sweet time getting there. And of course my other guys are up at the top of the hill. Rutka and Rain the Giant aren't going to get here very soon. Ice is doing pretty good here. Well, she's getting herself beat up. Rutka, who are you? Oh, but Kang can take care of this. Kang is just fine. Oh, Bard is getting his butt kicked. Bard, run away. They're supposed to be shooting your bow and not fighting him. Okay. Where are you guys going? Oh, they're going to go attack the bowman. Rutger, you're not hitting very well. All right, I think we've got them under control. Looks like Hot Lungs got hurt. Uh, these guys are not hurt too bad. Griffin's the worst of the lot. The farming crew got worse of it. Ice and Bard, Terran, Cud. Take this guy out already. 
need to get ourselves all healed up. Okay, so now farming crew. Uh, let's get you guys back over by the farms. Oh, bloody heck. This is such a nightmare. You guys need to get over here. Um, Griffin, you need to come down here and start looting these guys, because... I want to take his weapons away. That's all I'm interested in doing here is just getting away their weapons. So if they stand up, they can't actually fight us. Well, that was a hungry bandit. Oh, no, there's one out here. And then there's one here. Come on, Griffin, get to to move on. Quit stealing. Attack him. Let's take his stuff. It's more just to keep you from attacking us when you wake up. Uh, Kang, I think we're going to have to have you do the same thing up here with these guys. Where are they? Oh, bloody heck, where did they go? Out here. So have Kang come up here. Uh, losing a lot of time here. Uh. Urk, come on, Kang, get up here. Run. Get rid of his weapons. Get rid of his weapons. And give those to my crossbowmen. All right, so they don't have weapons. Uh... Where these guys go off to? Okay, we're going to be doing this. Alright. Okay. Don't know where Griffin... I think Griffin and the Hotlongs might be going to go sleep. Yes. Alright, Kang. That means you're on machine duty. Okay. So these guys should be doing their thing. I'll check on them in a few minutes. Let's go back to me. Uh, I was talking to this dude when all of that terrible stuff happened. Where is he? Where is he? There he is. Let's talk to him. He's got the hat trader. He's got cubes. Side angle anti. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. Visored helmet. Black bandana. The difference between a black bandana and a white bandana. It's got red bandana. So this is a cap. It's a visored helmet. I 
That's 500 percent. 32, 40, 9, 7. Oh, I have high grade, but 32, 40, 9, 70. So bad helmet. Masterwork grade. Okay, what do you have on? You have shoddy grade. Should I buy him a masterwork grade hat? Let's buy him a masterwork grade hat. He's going to be weighed down. He might as well look good, right? That's that. Sender Gaza. It has, like, helps with some acid, I guess. Straw hat. 40% on acid, 40% on acid. So straw hats. I guess I should learn how to make straw hats. Sleeve this long coat. This is masterwork grade, but... Save 60% on your acid. No coverage on your arms at all. Tricorn hat. Helps 20% on this. On the uh, acid thing. Okay. And this is a taggle mask, which I already know how to make. Iron hat. Iron hats do what? That's a straw hat. Does he have an iron hat? I don't see an iron hat. There's an iron hat. Iron hats help with 30% on that. Okay. What else does he have down here? Iron hat research. Mast helmet. Rattan hat, which I already know how to do. See, it's, it shows this here, but it doesn't show that I know how to do it. Then I was thinking about getting him this. It's 20,000. But it is a model mark, too. Right? Model Mark too, so okay. Those are good bloody things. This is even better. Model Edge Type 1. Okay. So there's things way up there. Oh my god. Such nice weapons. Should we bring back one of these? I mean, it would be Wecky's weapon of choice. Wow. Things that make you go wow. See, the thing is, is with these goggles, they take up your head space. And there's no hats that don't take up the whole headspace. They're only like too high. So it's very annoying that you can't have these and a hat. Man, I really would like to grab that, but it's 20,000 cats. That would cut me way down on my cats. Oh, but it's so good. So is this whole saber. Okay, so this one is Model Mark II, and this is a Model Edge Type 1. Oh my god. 20,000 cats for that. Oh man, he's got some really nice stuff. Oh, man, do I buy it? Did I give Wiki a really good sword? It's a katana class. I could actually give it to another person who uses katana. When I get back to town. I don't think I'm going to find anything like this out in the world. Now it's going to be a while before I can make these. I think I'm going to just go ahead and spend the money. You can get rid of that. I'm going to buy that for him. So he's got a decent weapon now. He's still at heavy weight, but okay. Ah, I was not expecting to find that in a hat 
merchant's house. Right? When are my when are my people leaving me? Four hours, so I still have a little bit of time to run around with them. Okay, so that was whoa. I did want to go over. Do I want to go to the library again? See if he's picked up anything. Let's go check out the library and then we'll check out the farm building. Yeah, Wecky's slowing us down. I should probably pick him up. We'd run faster. How soon are my people going away? Four hours. Still says four hours. So. Let's get in here and we'll talk to him again. Right, let's talk to him. Did he change anything? I think I already bought that, right? Take orders map. Didn't I buy an Ashlands one? I swear I bought one for Ashlands. Maybe I didn't bother because I didn't think I was going to go to the Ashlands and it was too expensive. World's End, I already know. I already know that. Oh, because it's 10000 I didn't want to spend the money on that. We have that. We have that. Okay, so we've got all the other maps. Uh, it changed. Doesn't look like he changed out anything. It's toppers. I don't know if I can make toppers, but I think I'm going to spend the 6,000 to see if I can get it into my weapon bench. Right, because I have that one, and now I've got this one. Because toppers, if I can get them up to that high level, whoa. Uh, shoot, bandana. Hold sabers. I don't know how to make hold savers. Trying to see if there's any uh, armor things that I want to get. Plated drifters leather pants? I don't know. I just don't know. I want to have like 400,000 cats and just buy all the research cubes. Then I can make whatever I want. See, there's drifters leather pants. It's going to take a lot of leather. And there's plated drifters leather pants. Which I don't know. <sighs> I don't know that I want to spend the money. I only have 30,000 cats left. And I'm going to need like 18 or 20,000 to hire the guys. Drifter's boots. What's this? Country value. Didn't I grab one of those? I thought I already grabbed this. I could swear I bought this already. I'll buy it again in case I didn't. 
Okay. Um, I really don't see anything other than maybe Drifter's Boots. So I can put people in Drifter's Boots instead of wooden sandals. It doesn't let me build a wooden boots. Yeah, there's nothing else really new here. So it's not like I can make samurai armor. I can make leg plates, but I can't make the armor. Yeah, I think we're going to say that we're done here. I've got 29,000 cats, and I want to go visit the farmer and see what I can get from him. Then I have to hire these other scenarios, and then we're going to head home. So out we go. I don't want to be in the map. I just want to go out here. Uh, turn myself around a bit. I haven't been in this building. I think that's a bar. But I want to run back over to the farmer. Everybody, let's go to the farm building. Actually, if I have Wiki go there on his own, so he's not running with us. He'll show up when he shows up, but I will get to the farm building quicker. I probably should check this thing out, too, before the end of the day. Okay, where's the farm guy? There should be... Oh, that's the bar. I don't want to go in the bar. I don't want to go in the bar. I want to go over here. We want to go in here. We'll bring Wacky over here too. So what have we got here? This is the guy I need to talk to, so I'll maybe move to here. And what does he have? He has animals inside his store. But you weren't allowed to take animals into buildings. Uh, oh, he has animals. So what's he got for supplies? Bull backpack. Garu backpack. Lots of rice weed and fruit. Even some raw meat. Hmm. That could be interesting. Very, very interesting. Wheat straw is not... I, growing that. It does have cactus. Cactus is always good for rum. Rice weed I can't grow. Nor can I grow green fruit. So I want to take those home. But he has animals. He has animals. What has he got? He has for 6,500 cats and age 36 and age 39. Oh, damn it. Seriously? Quit attacking me, you stupid people. He's playing dead. He's playing dead. Who didn't die? Who's fighting over here? It's a hungry bandit. Okay, well. Bloody hungry bandits. I'm about ready to try and put up some walls to keep these people from just coming from anywhere. How are you doing, Ice? Ice does pretty good. Just 
keeps running off. Okay, so we beat all these guys up. It's probably not doing any good for our re relations with the hungry bandits. <laughs> they just keep coming. They won't stop. Oh, ice got hit. Okay. Well, I think these guys will take care of themselves. Do some... Things like that. They'll head back off to doing their jobs. Griffin. How bad off are you? You're fine. Let's move you down here. Kang. You probably should go rest. Definitely hot locks. Um, who's got a splint kit? You have a splint kit. Um, we're running out of food, too. We're going to have to go back. So I'm starting to suffer from hunger here. So these two will rest for a while, get back some of their, especially the leg thing on hot lungs. That's that's concerning. All right, back where I was at. Uh, this guy has animals. I was going to buy something. What is he? There's animals. Okay, he's got thirty-nine year old. A bone dog. It's only age three. A thirty-seven year old. I was thirty-six before. Just grew up a year. Right in front of my eyes, it had a birthday. <laughs> uh oh wow. Should I get a garu? Should we get a garu? Let's get a garu. I'll come home to Molly and say, Molly, look! They've picked up a Weki and a Garu. I think I'm going to buy the Garu. Let's go ahead and buy the Garu. It's got a 12 strength and a 12 melee attack, so hopefully that's good for Garu. I don't know. I have no idea. We're going to buy this Garu. And we can get to name the Garu. You know what we're going to do? We're going to call the Garu as a sort of a joke. We're going to call the Daru. D A. W G Dog. This is my dog now. It has 151 hit points, so that's good. We now have a Garu. Now I need to talk to this guy because I'm going to not dog. I don't want dog. I want Dren to talk to this guy. And I'm going to have to get uh, a Garu pack. Let's put it up. Put him over here. Do that. He can open his bag. And now. Uh, I'm going to need some money, but I want to take some stuff with me. Uh, how, does, how do these things stack up? Oh, it has a huge backpack. Oh, my lord. It has a huge backpack. Six. So they stack in sixes. I don't know what the Garu eats. Maybe he eats green fruit. I don't know. I do know I need rice wheat for... Because I can't get it where I'm at. Um, bread's expensive. Cactus are cheap. Okay. Wacky, you're going to go ahead and pick up the rest of this meat and a dried meat to boot. And then we're going to turn around, get out of here. Let's get everybody out of the shop. That was, well, I've got dog. <laughs> uh, 
Alright, so if I go in here and I have Weki trade with Dog. Give me a Dog. Dog, where'd you go? I want to trade with you. Uh, okay. Um, got myself down to moderate. Don't think I'll get any lower than moderate. Logan, do you have stuff to trade with, Dog? Can you put that? Maybe we should put some food in there. Give dog a couple of foods. I don't have very much food at all. I've got all these things I have to, all these maps and things I have to clear out, but I can tip. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. Um, he has on one of those. I have on this backpack. That's empty, so I can have Dao carry the backpack? Might be worth it. I probably should have a couple of these out here. Weki, you don't have very many of those. Alright, I think that's where we're going to kind of stop with that. The dog is moving at weightless. The dog is moving at 17. He's moving at 15. Logan and I run at 22 and 23 miles an hour. We just run like the wind. Okay. So we've got our regular backpacks on. Wiki's got a this thing, this is what's weighing him down. I wonder if I can trade with Dog. Or do I give him the back? I go to lightweight. And I run my speed up to 16. That's what's going to have to be. 16 is going to have to be good enough for now. Okay. So we have a, we have an, we have Dog and we have Wecky. We've picked up some strays. Now what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to wait. What's my time? 37 minutes. All right, we're going to come out here. Uh, let's have everybody come out here. Can I go into this place? What is in here? I just want to make sure I know what's in here. This is a Tech Hunter bar. There's a mercenary captain there. There's a mercenary captain there. So it looks like I can hire some mercenaries if needed. Okay, so we're going to run ourselves out here. Like right to here. Let's see. Dog here has 151 head, 151 stomach, 151 chest. His legs are only 60s, front legs. His rear legs are 151s. And his blood's 120. Does he have stats? He has some very strange stats. How does he know how to use sabers and hackers and heavy weapons? And turrets, of all things. He knows how to use turrets. Can I sign dog to shooting a turret? <laughs> In the attack three, in the attack three. Strength four. It said it was supposed to be strength He's got field medic. Oh, give me a break. Can I actually give him the field medic job? No, I can't. Okay. So the actual thing works. It's just what the stats it shows you are, are incorrect. But he does run 168% hunger rate, so he's going to eat food rapidly. Like my hunger rate's at 80, he's at 80, he's at 72. And he's just a big old animal that likes to eat.
So we'll be feeding him a lot. It's a good thing we have lots of food. All right, and then we'll check on our tech. It's going to be one hour. So when we come back, we will have the mercenaries disperse. I actually should move myself farther away from a mercenary bar so I have a chance to catch people. Let's move all of us, move us over here. And then we'll put a cut in. Dog runs pretty quick there. The mercenaries will walk up here and then we'll stop. All right, we'll put a cut in here. Uh, when we come back next time, I will rehire my mercenaries. As many of them as I can. It looks like there was two captains in that bar over there. And then maybe I can catch one of these guys and everybody will have their own set of mercenaries traveling with them. And then we will head back towards the way station and at that point I think I'll only keep one group of mercenaries maybe for Weke to protect him because he's the fragile of us oh and my farming crew's getting attacked again well I'll go resolve the farming crew offline I think it's just those hungry bandits waking up and trying to beat on us again I'm gonna have to take away their weapons unfortunately I think I might take their weapons and just throw all the uh, hungry bandit weapons in a in one of my locked chests in my building. So when dust bandits come, they can steal the weapons <laughs> that I don't care about. All right, uh, if you like what you see, hit the thumbs up button, you really like to see, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notify bell, be notified, upload videos, and schedule streams. I'm John608, and until we meet again, stay safe, and bye-bye.